there. Welcome to Mickey Guru Travel Talk. I'm Christy and I'm your host tonight. And before we get started, we have some exciting news. We are all now on Patreon. Woo-hoo. So that means if you want to support our podcast stream, there's an easy way for you to do it. You just click on over to patreon.com slash Mickey Guru Travel Talk and you can sign up to be a sponsor of our podcast. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a good way to support the arts. Do you, right? do you get something? Small Christy? business. You do. You do. So you get <laughs> access to our episodes early. We're also going to do Ask Me Anything sessions, which, you know, of those. Oh, that boy. could get really interesting. I could get really interesting. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, like I like that idea. Especially since um, we're also going to share some of our before the episodes and after the episode conversation that doesn't always make it in. Shouldn't right. Make it in. Shouldn't make it in. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you have to pay for that content. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sometimes uh, it's a little. It right. might have to come with a disclaimer or two. Right, exactly. So Patreon's kind of like in the day when you used to like get your friend's cable box, his dad, and you know how to put the cha- right in between the channels, you know, or put right. a wire in the cable and you get, <laughs> you get like free stuff. That's kind of like Patreon, right? Uh, it's really like PBS. It's free like, free cable. Right. Oh, PBS. Yeah. It's, it's like PBS and NPR, right? Like <laughs> yeah. what you see, so, you know. Sign up. I like that analogy. It's yeah. classier than stealing cable. Than stealing right? cable, yes. yeah. Yeah. So. Alrighty. Well, let's get this show on the road, okay? Sorry. Okay. All right. Let's go. Beep, beep. Meow. <laughs> so today we're going to try something a little different. I've prepared a series of keywords, phrases um, that we're going to use to spawn five-minute discussions. Spawn. <laughs> <laughs> she said spawn. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to time it, and once the alarm goes off, no matter where we are in the conversation, we're going to move on to the next thing on the list. Okay. I don't know if I can do that, but okay. <laughs> right. Well, we're going to find out. You, with fine. your ADHD brain, you can totally do that. Yeah, I can switch gears pretty quickly. Yeah. All right. All right. So the first one, as I get my timer ready, is favorite meals. Go. Ooh. Favorite meals. Ooh. Like at Walt know, Disney World uh, or any Disney or, you know, or any just like spots. what you had today or. Well, no, not home. It's <laughs> oh my gosh. Lasalle, so I know one of my favorite. My Lasalle new favorite. Lasalle was yeah. mm. back when the um, paddlefish used to be Fulton's Crab House. Oh, yeah. Was that what it was called? Fulton's? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Kyle and I ate there when I was Wonderful. pregnant. It was just the two of us. And we sat out like on a little patio area outside. Right on the water. Right on the water. It's basically like a pier that came down from the boat. And they have, they had a chef that did nothing but slice up calamari. And it was so good. If you've ever had calamari, you know, it can be a little bit chewy sometimes. Mm -hmm. Not this way, not the way that it was sliced. Um, it was so good, and that was like one of my favorite meals ever at Disney. Good memories too. That's it was. My, it was my good first memories. time at Disney, so yeah, that was. Gina good. was pregnant, so the hormones were raging. So it was all you know, yeah. either good or bad. I think I didn't throw that meal up. So <laughs> she kept it. Down. Even better, you kept it <laughs> exactly. So Oof. my favorite meal was at uh, at Mexico. Really, yeah. really. So it That's was in San Mexico Angel at San Angel Inn. Uh, and it was the shrimp El Diablo. They used to have Sounds this good. great shrimp and pasta thing with like hot sauce spices mixed in together. It was really, really good. Um, and I think I had it on our honeymoon. Yeah. And the next time we went back, saucy, they didn't have it anymore because that chef had left and they changed the menu around and Aww. they haven't had it since. That's and a I've bummer. always been disappointed that they didn't bring it back because I really, really liked that. That was one of my favorites. We've eaten there a couple of times, and we've not had the best experience there. One time, we died laughing because we were sitting on kind of one of the tables that were closest to the like the kitchen entrance, Mm -hmm. and there was like a little ante room kind of where like the wait staff hung out. Mm -hmm. Yep. And there was this our waitress, and then like a couple of other like waiters and some other people. They would all gather there, and they were all talking, but they were talking in Spanish, you know. It's because like it's our own Telemundo. Yeah, and they were watching Telemundo. <laughs> yeah, and they were, and he's like, it's like that soap opera <laughs> that comes on on Telemundo, because it was like really dramatic. Whatever animated. was going on, yeah. they were yeah. all very animated about it, and. Like it was hilarious. Yeah, that's funny. But oh, that's funny. It made the service not be worth crap. Right. <laughs> we oh, were there because they were bad. absorbed in whatever was yeah, going yeah, on. There was, some, there was something big. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Right. Exactly. So what about you, Christy? So I actually was thinking San Angel Inn too, but more really? currently. Well, that's really surprising for you. Right. Because that's not white food. 
No, no. <laughs> yeah. And I was going to go with my typical way you'd expect me to talk about Liberty Tree Tavern. Right. I do love Tur- that. Turkey dinner, right. something along those lines. Yeah. Yeah. But I love at lunchtime at San Angel Inn, they have enchiladas. Okay. And those enchiladas, yeah. Allie and I, when we start talking about it, even at home, we're like drooling. Yeah. They're <laughs> so good. And they're spicy as all get out, which means I shouldn't like them, but mm-hmm. I do. Um, and it comes with a whole platter of stuff. And it is, it's really pricey. It was something like 30 something dollars for lunch. Yeah. Like, That's pretty pricey. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But they let me customize it, which you guys know I like too. Yeah. So that was. That was peanut butter and jelly on it. Right. PB and J enchilada. <laughs> Couldn't help myself. <laughs> no, gonna, I really gonna... enjoy um, Spice Road Table. Oh, yeah. You can buy sangria by the pitcher. Oh, God, it's and so it good. is so good, oh, especially. If you're mm-hmm. sitting out on the... Um, you can get white or red, right? Yeah, you can yeah. get white the or white red. wonderful. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And sit out like where you're overlooking the water and just get like appetizers. You can get like pita bread and hummus and olives, yeah. olives and stuff like that. Dates. It's, it's really, really good. Mm-hmm. It's a cool it's venue a, too because you look out over the water and you watch people come in on the boat and look confused and stuff. So you have some laughs. Right, exactly. That's <laughs> always do we fun. Go, do we go left? Do we go right? right. <laughs> go straight ahead. I've never nope. been into that place. Nope. You should try it. It smells on the way by. (laughs) (laughs) Someday. Someday we'll try it. All all of us together will go and we'll try that out. Watch Crispy Crispy go. uh, Right. Yeah. And I'll have to pretend when the waiter comes by to be happy like I do at Sanaa. Right. Right. (laughs) It's very good. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Please don't bring me more food. Have some more. I'll wait. <laughs> right? No. That's another lady who's like, oh, how about this? Do you like that? I'm like, no. no. She's like, all right, let's try this. No, I don't like that either. Yeah. Here, have your mac and cheese. Oh, there's something <laughs> wrong with this too. Can you bring me a cheeseburger? How about that? Oh, it doesn't you work. like... Um, you just go over to Boma. Bring me some food. You like hummus, Boma. don't you? No. Oh, no, no. Oh, you don't? Mm-mm. Oh. No. Okay. Oh, could, could you say that word again, please? Hummus. Hum- hum- hummus. Hummus. Uh-huh. Hey, Hamas. Time. What the heck? Oh, what time. am I saying? I don't know. Okay. Hummus. All right. Moving on. Uh, desserts. That's not very far, but okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Right? <laughs> wow. Hey, still on the food topic. Moving on. Right there. So just dessert. That's not a topic. That's a word. Well, favorite well, dessert? I know what it is. Least favorite dessert? It could be What's anything. Your, you know what? I don't like the gray stuff. No. I don't think it's that delicious. I don't either. <laughs> it was kind of bland, if you ask me. Yeah. I just kind of like... Is yeah, it, it's gray. The only way it could right? be worse is if they called it the tan stuff. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> well, that could be like, caramel. Oh, mm. Point. You get that the in your stuff. Yeah. Mm. My favorite dessert in all of Walt Disney World is the toffee cake at Liberty Tree Cavern Tavern. Really? Is yes. It? And it's literally like a toffee brownie, and it's got like that like melted toffee and stuff on it. Oh, it's so good. Mm. I don't remember it so. They still have it? They do. In fact, they used to only have it at lunch. It was like a thing that you could only get because their menu is different at lunch and dinner. Right. Um, and now they have it at night as well. Hmm. So, so they, they used to have a great chocolate cake there. It was like an ooey gooey chocolate cake thing. And then they changed it to being a flourless chocolate cake. Mm. And it's terrible. Yeah, I don't like flourless. Yeah, really, that's tough to pull really, off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Those, those really are tough to pull off. Yeah. Yeah. Gosh, I can't think of. Oh, like, all the I desserts know. are flooding. I know what mine is. The dessert of... that Kyle yes, had exactly. that I didn't get. Here again, La Salle. La Salle. Yeah. Yeah. It's like his own little pecan, pecan pie. pie. Yeah. Man, was it good. Oh, it was good. And I really wanted it because I didn't like whatever it was. I, <laughs> or whatever I had just didn't yes, compare yeah. to yep. what he had. But I can't. Um, it's not dessert. The kitchen sink was it, fun. Yeah, the I'm not a big dessert really guy, yeah. so but the kitchen sink was fun. Yeah. It's ice cream. Who doesn't I mean, like ice cream? That much yeah. ice cream and toppings. Yeah, that's pretty amazing. We've yeah. never yeah. done that. It had whole really? candy bars jam- yeah, jammed in it. No, we didn't. Okay, then I did the I did the the mini one on Main Street. Yes, then. That's yeah. the yes, we did do that one. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. one at Beaches and Cream. Somewhere. Yeah, has like Snicker bars in Milky Way bars stuck into it. Yeah, like whole bananas. Yeah, exactly. Isn't that something ridiculous, like 20 scoops of ice cream or something? Yeah, yeah. It's, um, yeah. there's like we no whole way. Can, whole can of whipped cream. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you've got to literally have like eight people to eat it. It's Yeah. Like, and eight people that you want to slurp your ice cream with. 
Right, because you're double dipping with the spoon. Right. It's not like you're oh, getting yeah. a new spoon. And it gets all try. melty and stuff. And yeah. I am not a food sharer by nature. Like, I'll share uh, with him. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's a family thing. Yeah, like, yeah. I wouldn't be like, hey, let's all, especially now, but hey, let's all get out of here. Oh, yeah, there's exactly. going to be a lot less of that going on now. I'm a food sharer. Like, I yeah. love to share my food. Yeah. If I ever ask you, hey, this is really good. Do you want a bite? That right. really means I want to bite yours. <laughs> <laughs> good to know. Well, yeah, exactly. That's and true. We did, we did that at Food and Wine Festival. Yes. Yeah. Right? We yes. did that. Everybody was like, here, have a piece so, of this, have a piece of that. I, right. I'm, I'm kind of like you. I'm kind of like, this is, this is my food. <laughs> I'm not used to sharing <laughs> food. Like, you, I mean, I'll give you a piece, but like, uh, I guess. So here's my thing, and I should clarify. I don't mind if it's pieces of things. Right. Yeah. But like if you're like, oh, maybe a butt of your egg roll. Hell to the no. Back right. Because you're getting like, your saliva your and stuff on the. I don't oh, want your no. stuff on my no. cannoli. I'll give you the end of my cannoli. <laughs> maybe if you like. I can't. Even before think, Y'all think about that stuff too. Yeah. Too, not too. I won't yeah. say too much because there's probably, it's probably a good thing to think about. I don't think right. about it that much. I just think that egg roll looks really good. Can I have a bite? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd be like, you know what? Yeah, sure, you can have it. Do you want it back? No, I'm good. <laughs> right. Mm. That's typically yeah. how I end up doing it because I'm like, that's not good. It was like the day you ate my crepe. That oh, crepe yeah. stunk. It did. Crepe, Come on. Crepe was fantastic, and then she ate it on me. It was that bad. It just how, didn't. didn't how even... big was it? Like. No, see, it was it folded wasn't... over into multiple pieces, so you could just take a nibble of it, and then foop, it was gone. It was like a seagull swarmed down and just scarfed it like boom, and it was gone. I was like, what the hell is this crepe that I was eating and enjoying very much? I like, do yeah, like this isn't very good. I was like, what? If it wasn't very good, why did you just eat it? I do like a good crepe with ice cream on it and like brown sugar. Of which that was not. No, it wasn't. No, I, I am not a crepe fan. I like I just have, yeah, you like them. Mm. I don't. I don't. How about funnel cake? Funnel cake. Oh, funnel I like funnel cake. I'm not a funnel cake guy. You know what uh, I was yes, thinking I, about? Fried dough funnel cake. I'm good with. Yes. <laughs> it's a dessert of type, like a dessert snack. But there is a caramel apple cookie over at the Caramel Cooch that is so good. <laughs> I don't know what the name of that place is. Close, that's basically close it. Close enough. Yeah, we'll see? go with that. I mean, that's what it is for us forevermore. It's kind of like people that call it Hollywood. Or uh, MGM. MGM, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, it's, that's just what it is. It's the caramel cake. And yep. time. Oh. All right. You know Next up, it. it's not going to be too far for this one either, actually. Drinks? Um, it, snacks. So, oh, snacks. Oh, First, well, there's this really good cookie. <laughs> it's a caramel cake. This place has crepes, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, James, one of our agents, the other day posted a picture of a pecan caramel apple. From oh, Caramel Cooch? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Which yeah. I'd never even seen that thing, but I'm ready to get Corona just to go and like, right? eat that thing. It's like a $15 uh, apple. You're like, you got to share that with like six people. Yeah. He's we like, my one. family. I'm like, I don't think well, we yeah, had that one before. He said that. He's like, oh, yeah, you know, we share it with the four of us. And I'm thinking, Christy's not sharing that. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen Christy eat we a caramel apple go, before. That ain't happening. <laughs> at the end of our trips, the last day, we would always go to Disney Springs and we would go to Goofy's Candy Store and at down, well, back then it was downtown Disney yeah. and get, I would get a custom made caramel apple yeah, and i would do dark good. chocolate oh God, with a white chocolate drizzle with coconut, coconut and pecans yeah. and it was so good oh, granny smith apple and it yeah, was just yeah. oh my gosh <laughs> i would share it Stop. i would let everybody have it i know but now we don't we don't do that anymore we don't go to, because we found out it was really hard to leave like it's better just to rip the band-aid yeah, off exactly oh, and yeah. just Once get in the car just that work. last morning yeah. and go we go yeah let's go yeah so we don't do that anymore well you're gonna have to fix that because i know i want to see a picture of one of those do they still do the custom ones can you still yeah, have yeah. as far as i know they do yeah wow. that could it's be really dangerous. good it's, they do them right. on main street too don't they or no um not the apples not the i think apples. they do the they, they have pre-made apples I they think. do like marshmallows yeah. and rice crispy treats rice crispy and, and stuff the weirdest things that yeah i don't like, like those yeah i don't what, even like that treats? Well, I like Rice Krispie treats, but okay. like the marshmallows. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And we yeah, were yeah. at Disneyland one time. I got one of the Fantasia Mickey apples. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. So it was like yeah. the red with the, and the Ooh, ears mm-hmm. were um, marshmallows. Ooh. Mm-hmm. And I was like, so I picked them off and I was kind of annoyed. I only bought it because I liked the way it looked. Right. <laughs> and I was like eating the marshmallow going, I don't understand. 
Why am I eating no marshmallows? Marshmallow. Right. I don't <laughs> like marshmallows. I like, apple. I like marshmallows by the campfire, but that's that's it. I don't that's... even really like them then. I'll do it just because that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. And I don't even really like to. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, you you do? No, I was just thinking about campfire marshmallows. Oh. Uh, didn't yeah. we do that at, your, at Dennis's? Yeah. We did. We did, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I yeah. remember that. It he had nice. the coolest fire pit. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah. yeah. That's, I like it a lot. Thinking, so Mickey bar or Mickey ice cream sandwich? Uh, ice cream sandwich. Ice for cream me. sandwich. Yeah. yeah. Ice cream sandwich. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Yep. It really depends on my mood. I like them both. I'm a Mickey bar girl all the way. They, yeah. uh, they over salt it. The chocolate seems just to be really salty. I love it. Yeah. I like I mean, the, there's nothing wrong with that, but yeah. Yeah. I actually like the chocolate covered banana. Oh it's like, yeah. It's a frozen yes. banana with chocolate covered yes. on the outside. I used of it. to make That's those at home. Good. Really? Yeah. It is. Yeah. Good. There was always these kits that were in the produce section mm-hmm. by the bananas. Mm-hmm. That was the chocolate. You just heated it up, and you then I would like pour it in a glass, and you had cut your apples. I mean, your bananas up and mm-hmm. on a stick. They came with popsicle sticks, and yep. I'd make them at home. They were so good. Yep. I do like a chocolate covered banana. Yeah. But you know what else I like that you guys turned me on to was um, a chocolate covered pineapple. Oh God, yeah. yes. Yeah. At, That's right. In Animal oh. Kingdom, they have them, and then also a big <laughs> uh, storybook oh. circus. Oh mm-hmm. yeah. If we're talking about things they turned us on to, let's talk about the the carrot cake cookie. <gasps> oh yes. Oh, right. oh, yeah. yes. Hands yes. down. The, oh the my best gosh. Thing. Yeah, that's yeah. the best thing they've they've ever made. That, yeah. that was just crazy. Yeah, I ate one about, I ate an entire one by myself one time and really, I was sick, but I was glad I was sick. I was, <laughs> right. You know what it is? Right, you were sick. It was worth it. Right. This is the most miserable, happy, yeah. sick I've yeah. ever been. Yeah. I don't know what to feel anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Like the sugar's just coursing through your veins and you're like, yeah, that's a big, yeah. so good. Yeah. That's a big huge. cookie. I yeah. think you may have had one or two bites off of it, or maybe the girls had a bite or two, yeah. but it was literally, you know, it was, it was that big. Around. When my mom yeah. goes, we always get one, and she, I share with her, too. Mm-hmm. They're yummy. I like yeah. them. Yeah. If I haven't had one, uh, get one. Yeah. Course, yeah. If we're actually talking about sugar comas, we'd have to talk about Tonga toast, but I don't know if we have any time to get into that. No, because it's not mm-hmm. a snack, so it doesn't true. go here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah that's, that's true. right. Yeah. Um, yeah. Think I think else. the cookie, they, um, the carrot cake cookie is now at the trolley station. There, That's the Starbucks. That's yeah. in, um, I think that's the last time I knew where it was located. I'll say this real quick. If you're looking for savory snacks that are really, really good, get the uh, cheeseburger egg roll in the Magic Kingdom. Oh, yeah. Mm. Or the, did they have a Reuben one one time? Yeah, they it did. Just it, they have some just sort of other one. Yeah, the Reuben Time. One. Wow. Oh. <laughs> got it in. Got it, in, got it in, though. That's yeah. good. Very good. All right. Next topic is adult beverages at Disney. Ooh. Never had one. So Ooh, I was t- t- say, not, not really uh, <laughs> haven't partaken in many of them. Oh, I think I know what it is. Well, we've had the sangria at Hoop Did You Review. I mean and that was good. Way too much yeah. of that. Yeah. Uh, in fact, it's gosh. We were there with my whole family. Yeah. And we were sitting there and, and oh goodness, as you guys know, right. we don't drink very often. Mm-hmm. Right. And I looked across the table at one point and Allie had these big giant eyes <laughs> and she was like Mom? And I'm like, what? She's like, who's in charge? <laughs> and we were like, what? Like, what? We're, we're all in charge. She's like, mm. every one of the adults is drinking. I'm like, well, we're taking a bus back to the hotel. Like, we don't need to worry about that. She's like, but who's in charge? I'm like, I'm oh my still gosh, in charge. that's hilarious. I'm still in yeah, I remember that. that was I'm still in charge. charge. Listen to me. I'm still yeah. in charge. It's fine. I'm like, I'm not like I'm falling down on my face drinking. I just yeah. am having a couple of things. I'm in charge. Golly. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'd have to go by park on yeah. favorite drinks, yeah. and then for Magic Kingdom, we could maybe do, do Skipper Trader Sam. Sam's. Yeah, that's true. We can yeah. do that at the Poly, right? <clears throat> so at Epcot, it's probably oh, that's a toss up. Yeah. It's either the Blood Orange Margarita at La Cava, or um, the Grand Marnier Slushy. One that's of those two. One too, yeah. Oh, I did have that. That's right. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. That was really good. That was yeah, good. That's now, right. You mm-hmm. tried mine. Yeah, it was yeah. good. When, when the food and wine is going on, there's a Florida stall that has a cucumber. Um, watermelon? It's a cucumber watermelon. Mm-hmm. Like, is that a little lemonade in it maybe? But anyway, cucumber know. watermelon, of course, with vodka in it. It's, it's Why not tasty. just have a glass of water at that point? Cucumber and water. A cucumber, watermelon, and vodka. It's, it's subtle appreciation. Yeah, right. It's all good though. Just put a potato in it. You're all. Mm-hmm. I know. It, Y'all I know love it, those. It, 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 animal, can we jump to Animal Kingdom? Yeah, Animal Kingdom. The, the Bloody Marys at the Dawa Bar. Um, Dawa Bar are 
uh, it's not that they're super great or anything, but they're just an average, bl- average bloody, bloody mary. mary but it's but it's having a bloody mary in Animal Kingdom in you know in Africa oh, that has like that. bacon and an olive and a tomato and a little piece of bamboo. Oh. So that really good technically bacon. falls into the snack category as well. Oh yeah, there's a lot of food involved in that. Yeah, yeah exactly. And it's good. It is really especially good. if you like bloody marys. Mm-hmm. And Hollywood Studio. Oh, um, good lord. Oh, I don't know what my favorite drink is there. Cause Anything at like the Brown Derby. Yeah. We love that little Brown Derby lounge yeah. area. Mm-hmm. We took y'all. That's where you got yep, your little toast. Yeah, mm-hmm. you know, my grilled cheese and tomato soup. Right, exactly. <laughs> it was like a crouton. <laughs> crouton, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember Christy's face. And she was like, um, where's my sandwich? Mm. You, it's <laughs> in the <laughs> soup. That's not a sandwich. That's a crouton with cheese on it. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Brought me somebody's like, salad. No, yeah, out. that's the grilled cheese. No. Yeah. No, that's not a grilled cheese. That's not. This is a bowl of soup. With you a lied. You mm-hmm. lied. Yeah. So I'm going to have to say the one that you didn't say, and I think you were going to, was the lapu lapu. Oh yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. we've actually yeah. that's something we've actually had there. Yep. So that was and that was really good. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. The, the um, it was so I'm good. A little Gina burned made out on those since right I made on. them at home. I was going to say it was so good. Gina made a video of how to make them. Right, so, right. It's on exactly. Our channel. Yep. Yeah, you have to check that video out. I really like the Dole Whip with rum. Yeah. Ooh, I at, um, that actually. Trader Sam's, they call it a spiky pineapple, but <laughs> okay. it's it's Dole Whip with rum. Um, and then on mm-hmm. Trader Sam's Terrace, which is the outside one, they have it and they call it the Dole Whip with rum. <laughs> it's the same <laughs> you thing. pay. You pay for the name. Yep. yep. Mm-hmm. Um, but spiky I love pineapple. that. Yeah. In fact, I was thinking about it just because I was, I made the list, I knew it was coming, and I realized there's a place down the street that makes Dole Whip, Ooh. Um, and I was like, and we have spiced rum. <gasps> no, so you're like, tomorrow. Yeah, I'm running over there tomorrow. <laughs> but we also know, we know how to make Dole Whip, too, because one of our agents, um, Christy, did a video yep. on how to make she Dole She made Dole Whip. Whip. So yep. we've got that covered, too. Right. Yeah. So what are you drinking, it. Eric? What am I drinking? I today have a, um, it's my green tea. I look like I can see down on. <laughs> so, right, yes, right. <laughs> it's a, it's a green tea and uh, whiskey. Oh. Or bourbon. Bourbon, Whatever, yeah. One of the two. Is it bourbon or whiskey? I, I don't know. It's, Is it's it a from blend, Kentucky it's a or not? It's a blended, so oh, it's I don't Canadian. know which one you call it. <laughs> it's, it's Canadian. Canadian. Right. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's funny. It's really good, though. Good. Cool. Yeah. Cool. All right, we have eight seconds left to talk about Disney. Christy, drinks. what, what okay. are you drinking? I got no other okay. drinks. I got no, no. Two, two, I know other one, drinks. Zero. Mm. Okay, so now we'll chat about what we have to drink before we <laughs> have a word from our sponsor. Oh, okay, so let's do that. I. Your new have... kids on the block. Are what? Cup. It's blue. It is blue. It's blue. It almost looks like alcohol, doesn't it? It does. Yeah, it's like, like that a blue Caracas. Yeah. 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 No, it's right. it's Gatorade. It's cool blue Gatorade. Oh my god! G two actually the low sugar version Ooh, yeah. shows up really well on the uh, camera. It does. Yeah, it does though. It's, it's it got a good, great. good color to it. I, I saw that. It. I saw that upstairs. I was like, Christy, well, why is there blue stuff in your cup? <laughs> like it's blue curac. What is it, curacao or whatever you call it? Yeah, curacao. I was like, whatever. wait a minute, we don't have that in the house. She's like, yeah, I know it's Gatorade. It matches <laughs> the X on the it new matches pictures. the cup. Yeah. It does. Right? It's beautiful. Exactly. It looks well fun. done. Well done. What yeah. Are you guys drinking. So we are drinking uh, wine tonight, which is unusual yeah, for us because we normally up. have mixed drinks. But we are drinking a uh, Merlot, and it is by uh, Menage a Trois. That was probably really loud in the mic. So. <laughs> uh, a, that and was geez. really loud, and B, wow. Yeah, yeah wow. <laughs> huh. I asked Gina before the podcast, mm-hmm. I said, do you know what this is? And she goes, well, yeah. And right. I said, yeah, of course Wait, I how do you know that? Okay. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. So, Why are you so familiar with that term? So are there three types of grapes in it? There must be. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's what I'm thinking. There's got to be a yeah. reason. Right. Yeah. Put them all in they a normally, barrel and smash them together. And right? See what through. happens. Right. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> the first um, of theirs I ever had was a blend. And so that's where I kind of assumed that they must blend their grapes. It was a yep. red blended. But... um. They've since come. This is a straight up Merlot, but I guess there could be several types of grapes that make. Or there could be several Merlot grapes in there. Yeah, right. It, it, might, it might not be straight up. It might not. Be a little special. Yeah, yeah. it could be. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, isn't that kind of a given? 
I mean, think? It, yeah. it, uh, yes. <laughs> I guess we could. Yeah, let's not. Woo, let's go. Into it. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon content. Patreon content. <laughs> All right. On that note, let's stop yeah. for a moment to get a word from our sponsor. <laughs> Do that. Good idea. We all know vacation planning is stressful and time consuming. Let the expert vacation planners at Mickey Guru Travel Company handle the details and find you the best deal possible, all at no extra cost to you. Whether your vacation dreams are made of roller coasters and princesses or sailing on the open seas, they will help create a magical experience you'll remember forever. To learn more about Mickey Guru and how they can help you save time and money, visit them at mickeyguru.com. Well, so we are going to have just a couple more of our um, five-minute discussions. And uh, the next one is water parks. Nope. Mm. <laughs> eh. Hard pass. Well, come on. You have to have a favorite. I mean, Typhoon Lagoon. Nope. Yeah, because of the, 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 A, the wicked wave pool, because it's better right. than Blizzard Beach. Oh, no, wait. It is Typhoon Lagoon, right? Yeah, it is yeah. Typhoon Lagoon. That's where we went. Yeah, yeah and we had the cabana. Yep, yep. That's, I mean, I, I'll be honest. I, I only like the wave pool and the lazy rivers. The other stuff I'm just not a fan of. You didn't I, like the big tube that remember we all went in and we yeah. were with Allie and you, Christy, yeah. and we were spinning around. Was, we laughed the whole way down. I mean, we did. Yes, we did. Monocally, if I But I, I will have right. to tell you. That's called life fear. There's, there, <laughs> there was anxiety in that for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. there was. Yeah. That's part of the fun, though, isn't it? It's no, idea. not, I think not if you have anxiety, true anxiety. There's not like, yeah, okay. I mean, you, about that particular thing. Oh, okay. If you're anxious okay, about I that gotcha. particular thing gotcha. and you're doing it, I don't think it's, yeah. I could do without it. That you know, makes perfect sense. Yeah. I, I, I'm going to go with Gina on that one. I'm, I'm a hard pass on the, on the water parks. Well, and we really are convinced that Eric died by drowning in a previous life. Because <laughs> he has a very, I mean, like he'll swim, like you, yeah. you like to I swim and stuff. Right? But like fine. any of those like rides with water and yeah. stuff, he doesn't like that. No, like, mm -hmm. like uh, Cali River Rapids. Yeah, hard. Yeah, I hard don't pass. like getting, I'm not, I'm not happy about getting splashed on Splash Mountain. Because I know you can, you know, it's just kind of, because you never get really wet. You just kind of get yeah. spat upon. Well, I, I, don't, I, don't I don't know. know. I've gotten I've gotten really soaked wet. a couple times. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah, I mean, it um, depends where you sit. Sometimes right. you luck out. But I do like the water parks, but I'm just like Gina. What I want, and I love Disney water parks for this reason, it's not like a huge difference in price mm -hmm. to add the water parks to your, t your park hopper tickets. Right. Because I want to go and swim in the wave pool, and I want to do the lazy river, and I want a cabana. Cabana, right. yes. I was waiting for it. You yeah. have to have a cabana. Yeah. But right. you I, don't really want the water park. You just want a nice couch to sit on to watch other people. Yeah, in just the water chill, park. Out. <laughs> chill out, chill <laughs> man. Yeah. I feel like no. a little un like an inflatable couch or something would be nice for you. We could just bring it around <laughs> somewhere. Watch, <laughs> the com watch the commoners go by. I don't really want to do the rides. No, just or you could stay at Beach Club and have almost all of that included right. in your yeah. hotel. Yep. Yep. In your I do love Beach Club. Mm -hmm. Right. But I, yeah, I, I, see, do I like didn't the... enjoy that. Like I really didn't. I really didn't love the water park thing that they have attached uh -huh. to the park to the I, to the hotel. That lazy really? river, yeah, yeah. Think, is yeah. the yeah. best. It, was, it is. I like that lazy when river. When we went, when it was super busy, so like you couldn't really oh. enjoy the lazy river too much. No. Did you like, go with somebody else? No, I went with you because. The, uh, that we had a great you and i had a great time yeah. in that lazy river we did it was yeah. so perfect it's like and eight the, feet deep yeah right. and the best yeah. thing about the lazy river is is it can be in the middle of summer you know 95 degrees the rest of the pools are just this like tepid water that's just bleh. that lazy river it's always nice and cool yeah right because it's so deep it's awesome. yeah right yeah and right. it moves and that it water moves, yeah. i think they circulate the pumps and it keeps it cool Oh, the worst pool in the summer. Oh no! I know oh, this is uh, Animal Kingdom. Animal Kingdom. Yeah. Oh, it gets so bathtub, warm. It's like bathtub. It's shallow and it's like big, yeah. and it's just not good. And animals, uh, birds can fly by and. <laughs> Well, to be fair, birds can fly by any hotel. Any of them. Right, but exactly. But That's the, what I was thinking, the whole, too. There's lots of birds there. I mean, more oh, than any. The squirrels over here in Magic Kingdom, too. How'd that happen? <laughs> you know what I meant. I know. I'm sorry. I couldn't help it. 
I mean, we were there swimming in the pool one day, and here comes a flock like three ducks laying right in the pool, go flying, float by everybody. And I'm like, okay, well, that's something that's we'll see every day. That's happened at the Wilderness Lodge constantly. Like, we've been there first thing in the morning, and they literally have their whole little duck families swimming. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Um, but yeah, I always think about the fact that, like, where there's birds, there's poop. Mm-hmm. Like, exactly. It's a rule of thumb. That's yeah. A good one to live by for sure. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I do like the water parks. I um I don't I go there. You're, I think if you're a water park person, Disney has two great water oh, parks. Yeah, yeah, and I think Blizzard Beach is for your thrill ride water park people and Typhoon Lagoon is is not. Yeah. It's for like your big wave. If you like those big waves yeah. and that I, kind of thing. I've done some at Plummet and it's not it it hurts. I mean, you have to want to you have to be a little bit crazy. Crazy. Yeah. yeah. I guess you got to want it. Yeah, it is fun as hell. Right? It's fun as hell, but boy, is it, it's not, it's not comfortable. Really? Cause is it really that it's a fun? Rush. Yeah, it because is. Because you and Allie both, when y'all got off of that, were like, nope, not doing that again. Well, I wasn't going to do it immediately again, because if I would have, I would have started losing blood. But yeah. Done. <laughs> oh. Done. All right, next one is nightlife at Disney. I like the Don't nightlife. About it. I like to boogie. <laughs> Oh, the disco just go on. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, stop. Okay. We're going to have to pay for that. Sorry. Yeah, right. um, <laughs> and we only have one mm. Patreon person right now. So, right. Yeah. so, yeah. so there, there isn't any since they shut down Pleasure Island. Yeah. So what do you do at night? So that was What's my fireworks? Thing. Fireworks. Go fireworks. Go to bed. Disney Springs, a lot of people go over there at night. Get up in the morning, do it all again. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had an interest in wanting to go because we've talked at about night, this before. Yeah. We've ne- we're not like the. And I'm not picking on people, but like the Brazilians and the Europeans, they come and they party. Like yeah. after dark, man, they yep. are, they're what's keeping that stuff alive for Disney because that's, that's just their culture. But they like to be, that's when they, they socialize is at night. Night, night. Because yeah. they eat dinner late. They, you know, have drinks and they stay up late because they always wake us up when we're already asleep. And they're coming back. <laughs> well, we know, but we know, but we know that yeah. from Europe, the, yeah. from yeah. our trip so to Europe. Later, people, right. right yeah. They don't eat dinner until later and stuff. Yeah. Like we would go to restaurants at seven, and they wouldn't be open yet. Yeah, wouldn't be open. They'd be putting the tables out and stuff. Right, Right. you'd be like, "We're really hungry." (laughs) You crazy Americans. Where's the American restaurants we'd like to eat? (laughs) Well, you know, my thought too with that was that there's there's a lot going on at night. It just may not be like traditional, like what Pleasure Island used to be, like all the nightclubs and that sort of stuff. But I personally like to go to the parks at night. Yeah, there's no sun Mm -hmm. anymore. So it's like more comfortable for people like me that have painfully yep. white skin. Yeah. There's a lot of choice. That's a great thing too about mm-hmm. Disney. At night, the nightlife, it's just right. as much stuff to do there at night as there is in the day. Yeah. Even yeah. at your resort. Like you, you know, can go see Yeehaw have, Bob. Yeah. Right. Over at Port Orleans. You totally right. could do that. Yeah. yeah. I guess I We've just never don't, done that. No. We've never gone no. to see Yeehaw Bob. No. No. I guess no. I don't think of going to the parks as nightlife. I just think of that as continuation of what you're doing during the yeah. day. <laughs> yeah. You know what happens to me at the parks at night? This is so sad. You get sleepy. Yes. Well, yeah. But I like <laughs> to take a nap. You don't want to go midday. home. You're like, right. oh, right. my legs. Yeah. I'm so tired. Yeah. I like but a I nap at midday. So that night. You know what happens to me at night at the parks? What? I steal wheelchairs. Yeah. It's happened on multiple occasions. It don't give your wheelchairs. stolen. It wasn't it was stolen, right? And yes. We returned it when we were done. We hope that you. that's what happened, and there wasn't some lady that was in there going. Nobody, no. Uh, it no, was all by it's not itself. What it was alone, over in the bushes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So the poor lady was in the bushes. <laughs> we were <laughs> just left with a wheelchair. It wasn't stolen. It was. Oh, those shoes re- were. It was <laughs> being returned from whence it was left. Yes, it was helping people by. Don't grabbing quite understand it. that. Yes. Right. Yes. Like you know I, did, I really don't like here. We've had some really good <laughs> exactly. fun. Decision was wheelchairs made at night too. Yeah. Uh-huh. Wheel crawl. It was pretty fun. Christy, if I remember, you partook in a she wheelchair did. late at night yep, one night. Yes, wasn't that at Epcot when the that was, yes, it was. yes, because yes. we rode you through the English Gardens. Yeah. 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 At high speed, <laughs> if I recall. <laughs> the maze, <laughs> or as fast as we could push it. We were yeah. like, go faster. I was like, this is where I die. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that's where you got you almost got run over too, or you did get run over by somebody. I didn't actually get hit, but right, pretty close. We were coming over one night during food and wine on a weekend, mm-hmm. and you know how people are. Oh, food and wine yeah. on a weekend. 
It's crazy. And we were coming from locals. France. And yeah. I was Down walking the over the bridge. Yep. And some, I think it was a lady. A lady pushing someone in a wheelchair. And she was like going like a bat out of hell. And like uh-huh. through the crowd and like ducking through. And I went to get out of her way. And she like came right at me. So I oh almost God. fell over. She didn't actually hit me. <laughs> Wow. But then Eric was yelling, and I was like, oh, yeah. my God, like, what had just happened? So, and she was people like. People stopped and started paying attention when I started yelling. They're like, what's going on? Oh, yeah, I bet. And she never stopped. She never looked back. She was just like. Oh. And she, she was, was not. A mission. And her face was not like she had an emergency. This was just her thinking it was funny. She was laughing. Well, no, I think her emergency was it was, you know, late, and she needed to get to, you know, the next glass of wine. Yeah, probably. <laughs> right. Yeah. It was just a lot of that. You see a lot more of that at Epcot than I would like to see, unfortunately. Yeah. But I, agree. Anyway. I agree with that. Yeah. Especially on the weekend. Yeah. Um what were we talking become... about? Nightlife. Nightlife. I've never right. done that I want to do. <laughs> What's that? I want to go play mini mini golf at Fantasia Gardens mm-hmm. at night. Yeah, that would be fun. Yeah. It looks we so played nice. mini golf, but not at night? Fantasia. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I didn't know they were open at night. So the reason we've never done it at night is the tickets that you get that are included yeah, are before 4 p.m. Like right. You're right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when the sun's beating down on you like right. an impressive right. yeah. 10-ton weight. Ugh. Yeah. But I'm, I'm actually going to think the next time we go down, I want to do that because that mm. seems like a really fun night. Do you really want to pay for mini golf with our family? It never really goes well. I know. Uh-oh. <laughs> Not too competitive about it? No. No, that's not really it bad. at all. It's just that, like there's certain rules in mini golf that are adjustable as you're playing. And our daughters are and black and white. Certain people don't agree with that. Uh, so oh. it causes causes an issue. It's or been two. a long time since we played, though. I think she's yeah. old enough. Good now. reason for that. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes we just throw the scorecard away. We're just yeah. like, yeah, you know what? Let's no, just, just play through. Just go. Yeah. Yeah. Just do it. Because Maddie is very competitive. Yes. <laughs> and if she's not winning, she's yeah. mad. She, she loses her. Her groove. Yep. She's happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see, it's not, not worth it at that point. Yeah, exactly. 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 Score, Time. Score one score. Oh, good job. All right. Perfect time. Last one. Last <clears throat> one. Uh oh. Is VIP tours. Yes. <sighs> yes. Wow. Win. Can, can we yeah. go right now? Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> please. I'm ready. I'd like to phone a Kirk, please. Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah, that's actually one of the things <sighs> that right now they're not offering. Oh, really? They're not doing VIP tours because I have a client that was booked for one in August (gasps) and they called and said, "Mm -mm." That's really surprising because that's a big, that's a cash money item. That's that's like a big deal. Yeah. Interesting. And they they all know each other. Like, it's not like you're the, I get the, the tours that have like multiple people from multiple families coming mm-hmm. that don't know each other but like right. a vip tour is like you all know each other typically right. yeah i typically. wonder I no wonder they don't oh that's right they don't mix no, do they? They don't no. that's right i wonder if they're using the vip tour guides for other stuff and that's why maybe they could maybe be the, they're, they're, trying being, to, they're being the blue shirts i think probably maybe something to try to keep things you know. well and i think the other piece is um you know the vip tour guides typically use the fast pass lane at most rides some they have right. back entrances, remember? Yep. But um, they're using the fast pass queues for regular lines to handle the to social handle distancing. The oh, yeah. is that how they're going to do it? That's why they're not yeah. doing fast passes either. Mm. So I mm. think that might have something to do with it. Could be. Yeah. Maybe. Yep. Um, but that was, my client was so sad. And I've you know, been talking to her about yeah, Kirk I mean, and Todd on. and Whitney and like, oh, building yeah, it up. Yeah. yeah. She's like, what? Oh my God, sorry. Some of our favorite Disney people. That's really really disappointing like maybe she's not as disappointed as she should be because she doesn't know she (laughs) She hasn't hasn't done it but she (laughs) should be really disappointed disappointed for her than she's disappointed exactly like she was going to have the best day ever at walt disney world like hands down best day ever and now she's not luckily she goes every year so she'll just move it to next august instead oh i bet you can hear that on the microphone quite well yeah sorry <laughs> Pour more wine. <laughs> That's wine. He's not going to the restroom. Well, you can't leave a bottle of red open, you know, because it'll it'll oxidize and then it's no good. So you got to drink it all. Right. Once you open huh? it, it's got to go. It's got to go. <laughs> so I okay. want to do another VIP tour. And when we did it before, we remember, I remember we talked to Kirk about how you know people waste a VIP tour by going to dinner, like and sitting down. And oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. And then he had said to us, actually, some people really like that. And mm-hmm. that makes a whole lot of sense because yep. one of my favorite parts is, you know, it's cool to let them 
show you around and people to wonder who you are as you right. walk through the park. Right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's us. Um, but I really <laughs> love their stories and I love talking yeah. to mm-hmm. them. So the av- ability to sit down at a table and have a conversation seems like really cool to me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. It'd could. almost be like dining with an Imagineer. If I had the money, I would yeah. do it. Yeah. I would just have one every time I went. I'd just be like, hey, dude. I know. Right. It's really hard to have one. There's a hundred grand. Do me. And then, <laughs> not, you know, do me the favor. <laughs> I, was, I, was I was waiting like, for the next line. Like, hold on. We're just going to uh, leave that on the hook. Right. And we'll just bait it and we'll see what do happens. Do me a favor. Back, back. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I would good? do it. I, mean, I would do it I mean, every time. I don't know. Oh. All right. Anyway, <laughs> I would get one every time if I could afford it. I sure. would too. And it is one of those things when you're done, like you did it. I remember like right after the first time we did it, we had one for 12 hours that time. Yeah. Um, we looked oh, the at VIP each other. Tour. Yeah. 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 And we were like, oh my goodness. Like how you ever do how Disney gonna normal? How are we going to go back to like real world? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Right. That was that was something special. Yeah. Why am I waiting in this line? Like, is, right? like where do you put it in your trip? Do you put it in the beginning? Oh, I know, right? Or do you put it at the end? I always recommend the end because then yeah. you, A, you can do whatever you've missed right. during the week. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I also kind of feel like that's, you end on the high note. If you right. start yeah. with that. Yeah, I mean, that's like, yeah. that's like yeah. the climax to your put, trip right there. Put that's the right, really, exactly. Put the bar way too high. Yeah, if you do that on your first I mean, day, you're just kind of like, second day, you're going to be like, it's a and I just forgot that when we back to back to the hotel. Right. Sit there. When we did it, we did it back to we had two eight yeah, hours. We, yeah, we made a so whole day of it. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. So yep. that's oh, that's not even the normal way to do it. You only get them for seven hours, unless you got a ton which of money. sounds like a lot of time, but really right. it, it goes, goes by, by really very quick. quickly, yeah, especially if you're hopping parks, yeah. right? Even, like you know, they'll take you in the back way and stuff, which is really cool. So you don't have to worry about the lines and all that stuff, but we did three parks that day, right? Yeah. We chose not to do Epcot. We didn't do Epcot, but yeah, we did three other parks. Yeah. Cause at the time there really wasn't, and there still isn't really a need for a VIP tour guide at Epcot. Right. Not yet. Not yet. Uh, Oh, soon. (laughs) Very very soon. All right. Well, that'll do it for us. So what do we think? Did that work out fun? Did we have Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Yeah. I hope everybody else likes it. It was kind of cool. That was fun. Cool. So um, let us know what you think. We really want to hear if that's something you want to have us do again, because clearly we would do it often if uh, if it was something that you're interested in. Exactly. (laughs) Tap into some other ideas. Yeah. Uh, And again, visit us on social media. We are at Mickey Guru Travel Talk on Instagram and Facebook. On Twitter, we're at MG Travel Talk. And at Patreon, we're at patreon.com slash Mickey Guru Travel. So until next time, friends. Bye. Safe travels. Bye, everybody. <laughs> you normally say see you real soon to start with. I know. Like, and you didn't. You just to to I was like, oh, wait, she's right on me. <laughs> the Gatorade's going in my head. Right. See you real soon. <laughs> Bye, everybody. <laughs>